How sure will your father is in there? Well, our spies in the capital say he's here, and they've been right so far. Rao, I've got a squad of stormtroopers in front, plus multiple cannons. Copy that, Spectre 5. Moving to your right flank. Sabine, doesn't it seem suspicious that the Empire would move your father so far from the capital? My father has many friends. He's not just important to me. The Empire probably locked him up out here to prevent someone from attempting to do what we're about to do. That may be true, but I'd put nothing past these Saxon clan traitors. We're in position, Spectre 5. Copy, Rao. Over. All right, Clan Ren. Check your fire for the captive. We're going in the front door, on my lead. What's wrong with you? I, I wish I had more practice with this jetpack. You're a Jedi. I'm sure you'll pick it up on the fly. <laughs> Yes, on the fly. I get it, Chopper. Target acquired! Sir, we have a single target approaching from the north. Correction, multiple targets. We have multiple targets. Anticipated, Sabine Wren is leading the attack. You may do away with her allies, Commander, but I want her alive. Lord Saxon, I, I cannot even guarantee we can hold the tower. I know how stubborn Clan Wren can be. That's why I've dispatched reinforcements to help you. Well, this just got more. Jedi, or she dies. Surrender now. <laughs> Don't just stand there, protect her. It's concrete. Fall back! Abandon the base! 
Where's your father? The outpost is empty. There's no one here. This was a trap set to lure you in. Your mother received this intel, but she couldn't get word to you. The Empire was jamming all transmissions. She sent me ahead to reinforce you. I understand she's on her way. Who are you? Kanan and Ezra, this is Lady Bokatan of House Kreis. Her sister, Satine, once ruled Mandalore. Bokatan was made regent by the Jedi before the end of the Clone War. She's still seen by many as Mandalore's rightful ruler. So what happened? After the Empire took over, I refused to obey the Emperor and was betrayed by the Saxon clan. Your commitment to Mandalore's freedom is legendary, my lady. This belongs to you. I had my chance to rule and I failed. I am not my sister. I am not the leader you seek. See if you can contact my mother. Right away. You know, your home planet is very different from mine. Once upon a time, these plains were covered with grass, but I never saw it. This destruction happened before I was born. And it never grew back? Never had a chance to. This is what continuous war has done to my home. Well, maybe... Maybe this is your chance to help change things here. Not happy. Not happy. Not happy. Mother, any news? The Empire's changed their plan. They're moving your father back to the capital for a public termination. I don't see anything yet. Just give my mom a chance. We were hoping you could have freed him by now. What's the outlook? The Empire is moving Sabine's father to the Mandalorian capital of Sundari. Only chance we've got for a rescue is to ambush the convoy before it gets there. And what's the status of the Imperial occupation? Mandalore's under complete lockdown. Civil war's raging. I'm sorry. I hate to say it, but... It sounds like the planet is lost. Sabine's father is important. Not just to her, but to her people. That's how I persuaded Mon Mothma to let you help. But once that's done, I need you to come back. Oh. Having trouble overthrowing the Empire without me? Our team is an important asset to the Rebellion. An asset? Is that what we are? You know what I mean. Well, you know how I feel. Are we still talking about the mission? That depends. On what? You know. <laughs> Be careful. See you soon. Yep, that's my mom. Blowing things up definitely runs in your family. It's a Ren specialty. Sabine, we've engaged Tiber Saxon's Imperial dogs. The prisoner convoy has changed course toward the canyon. Then the diversion worked. There. I'm scanning a single passenger, no armor in the center transport. The one most heavily guarded. If we attack the lead vehicle, my father's transport will fall back. Then someone could sneak up and sabotage its controls, forcing it to stop. 
By then, the rest of the convoy will be too far ahead to do anything about it. So, who's going in? Yeah, that sounds like a me plan. Are you sure? You haven't exactly mastered that jetpack yet. Hey, I got it. You can do it, Chop. Just get ready to jam their comms. The traitors are putting up a stronger fight than expected. What's your status, Captain? We have altered our route to avoid the battle, but remain on schedule, Governor Saxon. Good. Continue to Sundari with the prisoner. I am ordering the weapon to be readied. The rescue effort failed, traitor. We will reach the capital within the hour. I do love the capital. It is a masterful expression of our architecture. I'm glad you enjoy it. It will be the last thing you see. Go easy on him. No chance. Sir! Paint. I can't see! So be it. I've got a better idea. This is where we get off. Ezra, quit messing around and get my father out of there. Yeah, working on it. Are you with Sabine? Yeah, I'm with her. Well, I mean, not with her, with her. I'm just friends with her. A cliff? What cliff? Are you a Jedi? Let's hope so. Ezra, get out of there! Take this, sir. 
How will you get out? Trust me, I'm better off without it. Captain Hark, is there a problem with the prisoner? The renegades and their Jedi allies attacked my convoy and were able to liberate Ulrich Wren. They planned well. Withdraw all remaining forces. I am going to deploy the weapon. Before the end, they will all kneel before the Duchess. Thank you, young Jedi. Father. When I got word that you had returned, I did not believe it. And... Sabine, you are my daughter. I was pleased then, even more now. Well, we would never leave you in the hands of the Empire. Oh, that was fine. I meant your artwork. You've progressed. Your use of color and line is better. Better? What do you mean, better? It's great. It's getting there. Your design aesthetic is still derivative of the pre-exile masters. Well, Tojin was an influence, obviously, but I made it my own. I thought you had a sharper eye. Now I see where Sabine gets her creative side. Oh no, Master Jedi. Sabine's artistry comes from her mother. Ursa knows how to destroy her enemies in so many creative ways. And here I thought we were rescuing another warrior. Hmm. My dad fights with his art. We need to get moving. We're too exposed here. Countess Ren, we've rescued your husband. Ulrich is free. Then we have two victories today. Saxon's forces are in retreat. Hold on. They're not all running. Looks like we've got an incoming Imperial transport. Reinforcements to cover their retreat? They've deployed a single scout walker with no other support. It's moving into attack position. Laughable. Destroy it. That sound can't be. Tristan, get out of there now! Mother? Tristan? What is that? No. Let's go, Chop. No, no. What happened here? Where are the survivors of this battle? The wounded? The victors? I see. Only the defeated. Mandalorian armor? What could do this? A weapon did this. A weapon...
created by my daughter. There were rumors the Empire was working on a weapon to neutralize Mandalorian armor. That it had even been tested on our people. I, I didn't believe it. Not the Empire. Me. This is all my fault. Sabine, you can't blame yourself for this. You tried- Everything my father said was true, Ezra. This is my work. I created the weapon that did this. And because of me, the Empire is going to turn my world into a graveyard. Because of me, Mandalorians are going to die. My mother and brother are... <gasps> Tristan! Mother! Mother, Tristan, I, I thought I lost you. We were caught at the edge of the weapon's range. Thanks to your warning, we made it out. The others weren't so lucky. Ah, ah, Choppers picked up something. Survivors? No. The Empire's coming back to finish the job. are down. A Mandalorian with a jetpack is a weapon. I'm not a Mando... Mandalorian? I don't want to be a Mandalorian. Recording, you will see the first test trial of the weapon used against Clan Ren. As you see, 
the arc generator's energy pulse is drawn to the Beskar alloy in the Mandalorian's armor, superheating it and instantly vaporizing the target. And all the while, doing no harm to our Imperial stormtroopers. The weapon is fully operational, as promised, Grand Admiral. Effective, yes. But you miss the true artistry of this weapon, Governor Saxon. It turns an armor, legendary foot strength, into crippling weakness. And it strikes at the very heart of your people's tradition. You said the Emperor wanted this uprising dealt with quickly. This will end it. You're different than your brother. How would Gar Saxon feel about you betraying your heritage? He no longer feels anything. I have evolved. Mandalore must evolve with me. Once your people see their sense of security turned against them, do you believe they'll swear loyalty to the Empire? A Mandalorian without armor is no more than a common soldier. Fear will compel them to join the Empire. We shall see. Of course, the weapon's range is far more limited than you promised. Or perhaps you thought I wouldn't notice. I only had pieces of the prototype. I've done everything I could. You cannot make it work properly because you do not truly understand it. You need the weapon's creator. You need Sabine Wren. Governor, I mean no disrespect, but what will stop the Empire from using the weapon on us as well? Unquestioning loyalty, Captain. Now, find Sabine Wren. You told us you destroyed it. I did. The Empire must have rebuilt it. They... You're a Mandalorian! Why would you create such an abomination? This is the weapon of a coward. I was young. It was a challenge, and I was arrogant. But when I realized the Empire tested it, and actually planned to use it, I sabotaged the prototype and destroyed the plans. I thought that was the end of it, I swear to you! Okay, so this weapon only targets Mandalorian armor, right? So why not make your armor out of something different? Ezra, the armor I wear is 500 years old. I reforged it to my liking, but the battles, the history, the blood, all lives within it. And the same goes for every Mandalorian. This armor is part of our identity. It makes us Mandalorians who we are. And now it's going to make us dead. Sabine did everything she could to stop this from happening. You must believe us. Any attack on my daughter is an attack on Clan Red. No. Sabine, what are you doing? I'm prepared to take responsibility for my actions. It's true. I designed the weapon as a loyal student at the Imperial Academy. The Empire is using my prototype, but it's only functioning at a fraction of its capacity. At full power, it will destroy armies. So, you've got a choice to make. We can fight each other, or we can destroy this weapon once and for all. I understand your anger. In many ways, I feel the same. But Sabine is right. Now is not the time for us to be divisive. She knows the most about this weapon and how to destroy it. We need her. It's time for you to prove your loyalty. Not just to your family, but to all of Mandalore.
Saxon has worked hard to keep the weapon a secret, so he likely has it aboard his Imperial Star Destroyer, outside of Sundari. Needless to say, it will be very well guarded. Once we get inside that ship, we'll need two teams. One to find the weapon, and one to wipe out every shred of data on it from the Imperial computer systems. This weapon? Is there any way it could be turned against the Empire? I've studied Stormtrooper armor, and while the thought has crossed my mind, that, that isn't our mission. No. No, we have to destroy it. I will lead the attack team. With respect, Countess, you can barely hold a blaster. I'm just as good with my other hand. Yes, Mother, but we'll need you for tactical support. So be it. If I can get to the weapon, I can make sure it's destroyed. I'll get you there. Ezra and I will take Chopper to the data core. All right, let's go over our infiltration path. I'm surprised to see you so swayed by Sabine Wren. You seem to be as impressed with her as I am. I had my doubts, Rao. But she came back to face her past, and her bold initiative has impressed me. She has become a courageous leader. She reminds me of the best of who we were, and could inspire us to become more than we have been of late. I will not allow her efforts to be wasted. Ben Rao, that's helpful. Best bet they're working on the Duchess up there. The Duchess? You named your weapon after my sister? The former ruler of Mandalore. It was a series of bad decisions, okay? Hey, hey! so dangerous like this. What's that sound? Oh no, it's been activated. Stay back, Captain. Oh. Sabine Wren. You truly are brilliant. Except for thinking you could infiltrate my ship unnoticed. Sadly, as much as I would like to end your life, I need you alive. You are going to upgrade your little experiment and deliver a weapon that operates at its full potential. Never. Let's see if I can persuade you. Governor, stop! This is too much! I understand using the weapon against rebels, but if she makes it more powerful, how will we prevent the Empire from using it against all Mandalorians? I am the Empire! Palpatine has shown me the way to true power. This is not enough power to kill you, just to teach you a lesson that in the end, all of Mandalore will bow to me. Will you hurry up?
Erase everything, every piece of data on that weapon they've got. Sabine, we're in. What's your status? Sabine! She's in trouble. Go! Chopper and I will finish here. Don't move! Oh, oh. oh I'm moving. My mission? Now I have to finish yours too? The data core was the easier mission. Will you two oh. knock it off? Where's Sabine? Up there. Are you impressed by how well your weapon works? I believe you can do better. Help me to increase the range of the weapon, or she will die. Stop! I'll do what you want. Sabine, don't! You're doing the right thing, Sabine. This weapon of yours, it can unite the houses. It can bring peace. As long as our people are on their knees before you and your Emperor. Mandalore must adapt to survive. Would you rather we destroy ourselves in a fight that cannot be won? At least we die free, as true Mandalorians. It's done. The weapon is at full power now, but I'm begging you, don't use it. I'll take that into consideration. At what cost? To beat the Empire, this is the only way. It's not our way. It's their way. You came here to make things right. Will the future of Mandalore be one of honor or cowardice? <laughs> Hope or fear? The choice is yours. Or Mandalore. Whoa, hey, no, it's, it's me. Well, that looks bad. Kanan, power core's been breached. Well, the data's wiped, but the stormtroopers are recovering and heading this way. Don't worry about them because this entire place is about to blow. We should probably go then.
This is only the beginning. The Empire will send everything they have to crush Mandalore. That is why you should lead us, my lady. You had the courage to make a difficult decision. With your guidance, you have the wisdom of a ruler. There's no one I trust to wield the Darksaber more than you. And I am not alone. Clan Bisla is with you. Clan Rook is with you. Clan Elder is with you. Clan Kreese is with you. The Protectors are with you. Clan Wren is with you. Now I understand why the Saber came to me. It came to me so I could pass it to you. I accept this sword for my sister. For my clan and for all of Mandalore.